A Twitter user is saying, never marry a girl raised by a single mom. You will live to regret it. I think for me, one of the disadvantages of social media is that it gives so many people a platform so they feel like Not they can so just say gives anything. Idiots. Yeah, I wanted, yeah, I didn't want to go too far and call her an idiot, but it gives so many people that are probably not okay in the head. It gives them a platform. What she said is absolute And it's even nonsense. more annoying that some media platforms use their use their space to illuminate this stupidity yes. just because they want to create engagement on their platforms. Mm -hmm. I don't, I don't see the sense in what she said because there could be different reasons why you become a single mother. What if your spouse died? Mm. So if you did not get married and you raised your child, that child is going to be problematic. I think, once again, it still boils down to this ideal that people have created in their heads when it comes to family and what family should look like. It's like, you should have a father, you should have a mother and then the children. But then the truth is not every family is going to follow that dynamic. And if a family does not follow that, that dynamic, it doesn't mean there's going to be something wrong with the children. There could be other people in the child's life that would be a father figure you know, mm. to the child. So this idea, I don't agree with it. I, it doesn't make any it sense. Like There's Benny nothing has something else. Yeah. I'll have, I'll have, You're going yeah. up and down. <laughs> I have a, di a divergent opinion to what both of okay. you are saying, right? Mm -hmm. And so I'll just try to maybe elucidate more on what she was trying to say that she didn't really get to say. Okay. You know, um, you know, she said, don't trust, don't marry a, a, a lady that was raised by a, a single, single mom. Now, there's an angle we're going to look at it from. That you will live to regret it. That you live to regret it. Now, mm. there, there could be an angle she's taking it from. It could be um, a woman who was divorced and maybe it was, it was a bad split. Mm -hmm. right. Whether you like it or not, she's going to constantly have, um, that's what they call in psychology right now, cognitive bias to constantly make that girl perceive a father as a bad person. It's not always like that. No, it's no, not hold on, hold always on, like that. No, 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 no. It happens. No, no. I, like have, I, have, I have cases to cite on this. All right, just because me and, me, me and her, we fell out, and she, I, I normally say women own children, whether anybody likes it or not, right? And so there's every possibility she will want to infuse a cognitive bias in those kids to see the man as a bad man. And so for the daughter um, who has been poisoned to think, you know what, depending on what level of things she says about her dad to her, she'll grow up viewing men differently. I'm so saying, what about wait, people who are raised on, by both wait, parents, hold on, but they're not together? Let me, can I finish? I'll land. I'm going to balance this statement. All right. So there's every possibility that guy will grow up not thinking of men in a very rational way, but subjective from the judgment and submissions of her mom. It's possibilities happening. We've seen okay. it severely. And then again, it's a mm -hmm. I've seen, unfortunately, again, I've seen, you know, like you said, the ideal family is, is I was raised in an ideal family, a father, a mother, and my brothers, right? Mm -hmm. That's an ideal family. But somewhere along the way, things might happen, life might happen. There could be a ton, twist of events. I mean, one, one parent might have to leave or maybe one parent died. It's not always the mom. It could be a father. Mm -hmm. Now, that's a different case. Now, I've seen a mom raise two fantastic, great, responsible men mm -hmm. into society. That's a different case. So I don't totally just want to discard what she said and say, you know what, it's, it's uh, nice, blah, blah, blah. Yes, it might sound so a little bit... So you yeah. right... You're saying if a single father raises a child, yes. it's the, the possibility of the child being toxic. It could go either ways. No, that's that's what you actually. It could go to. either ways. It's 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 reduced that when no, it's a woman. No, 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 and then no, no, when no, no, they no, 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 again, no, 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 let me finish. Okay, no, you take me out of context. No, no. You also that said sweet. you have to correct it. You also yeah. said that if a In single case, mother raises a son. Raising there won't be a problem. No. But once it's a daughter, it's a problem. I spoke in relation to her using a single mom. Mm. It could be a single father also. Okay, so, so everything we are case. saying, yeah. uh, if, I don't, I don't if you want to start putting examples to it, you will definitely find something somewhere or somebody somewhere that fits whatever you're describing. Yes. However, I want to say that it is not limited to single parents only because I have seen yes. children or adults that came out of the ideal, ideal family, family and still and have, have biases the most against huge men. Huge mindsets so, and biases I, I, I totally agree against with, men I totally and agree. women. It's not a function of you were raised by a single parent. No, this or is not. it, guys. There are dynamics. There are dynamics to every family. It's about being a good parent. Yeah, there are dynamics in every family. There are dysfunction in every family. You can still have your mother and your dad, and depending and on how you see. And be dysfunction now. Yeah. Let's be just call and I'm sorry. I have is. a few friends who were raised by both father and mother, mm -hmm. and you know, the children are skewed in their thoughts towards one parent than the other. Is a, is a dysfunction in family, mm -hmm. but is the propensity higher 
when it's a single parent. It is not. Yes. I don't think it's so. Not. Oh, yes, it is. It yes, it is. I don't think so. I don't think so. I don't, I don't want to be that's, that's, that's my humble I submission. I think for you know me, me, it still depends because there are people who are still married together and they don't like each other. It would be that better if they are divorced. And yeah. then those children who are raised in that kind of family would still have a bias against one parent or the other based on what either parent it's says a higher to them. It's a higher propensity when it's just a single parent. It is not. It, it would take a whole Actually, lot of I effort understand what you're saying, effort. but based yes, on I mean, the environment where we are, where most marriages, I still stand to be corrected, but then I'm standing on what I said. Elsa, most marriages are still together because they don't want, it's not necessarily because there's love because or there's because unity. You know, they don't want the stigma. Because they don't want the stigma, we must stay married and we have to stay married because marriage is from God. It is ordained for better, for worse. So everybody's in that toxic space picking and giving no, but whatever what negativity they, they, they had within them. If I had to grow because up in that of, kind of that, there's even more kind of possibility of having that kind of Knowing dysfunctionality that your together there. simply because they are afraid of your divorce. Not because they love each other, but they are just they are just staying together just for. Well, I was just trying for the that generalization. Of I don't. My problem with the generalization is yes. that there it is a, already sense. a lot of stigma Some. attached to, to being a single being parent. a single mother, and that is something we are trying to say. You know what? In fact, yeah, being a single parent, but when it comes to being a single mother, it's, it's even more, it's more. So we're trying to say that is not right. So coming out to put a statement a, like a this statement is, like is this. a problem. Very, I, I For me, if I want to take point. it personally, there are so many other layers I want to take it from, but I don't want to go that personal. Well, I don't want to discuss. this corona I, I time, to totally discard you know, comment, I totally discard that comment. It doesn't oh, make any hard. sense. If you that's want hard. to, if you want don't to make that kind like of, that. if you want to make that kind of comment, they come from a place of education. Don't it's come and make. It's just like when you say men are strong. Hello, are you coming from a place of education? Benny, yeah, that's, that's Benny. Is, that oh, oh, that's is, a different kind of fish. Oh, no, I see. Benny. Interesting. Benny. It's no, like feminism it's, it's right now. It's very different. No, oh, my God. We can expand, we can expand this table. Don't like, expand it. We can expand this table. Like, we have a lot of angry, bitter women all, all under the covering of feminism who are angry with the men who have done them wrong in their life. So now, I mean, relate, under the covering relate of that. feminism. Relate that it's still, to this. It's still the same thing. How is it the same? I mean, she's, she could be divorced. from a. It was a bad split. Did you understand that tweet? You said marry a woman raised by a single don't, mother say don't, and you will don't. regret it. Basically, it don't, don't marry. marry. Yes. So where exactly, Benny. what correlation does it have with feminism or men as scum? Well, what just, correlation? I just, you just said, Benny you is said generalization. Right now. He's I being mean, scum. You, being said scum. you are being <laughs> scum right now. Elsa said generalization. So if she, she could, you try, you're trying to discard her totally. I'm saying, is it a possibility? Does, does it happen? Yes. It doesn't mean it's every single, every single mom. No. And I'm saying that it is not just restricted to single parents, you know, single mothers, anybody, a single father. Yes, 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 yes Nimi. Exactly. Yes, yes Nimi. But it's but, a propensity higher with single parents. And I'm parenting. saying yes. her submission is driving the stigmatization we are trying to push away. Mm. Submission should be discarded. So it should be, as like the judge has said.